Hello guys, right now it's Mike at Polishes Foods. I just thought I'd show you a quick example without showing you or giving the brand away of what this specific dog food is, okay? But I will tell you it's a popular brand and a lot of people are feeding it. Right, straight away, the first ingredient right there is cereals. So the main bulk of that this product is cereal. Your dog is a facultative carnivore, okay? Therefore, they thrive on meat. So why is the first and main ingredient cereals? It makes no sense, right? But that's not all that makes this even more interesting. If you look at this, this table here, you'll notice that the, uh, this, this is the main bit you want to, to try and look at. Let's see if I can highlight it. No, I can't, unfortunately. But you're looking at protein, which is 26%, fat, 8%, crude ash, 8%, and crude fibers, 3%. If you add all those together, it gives you 45, okay? What you then do is subtract the 45 away from 100, because there's 100 and 100%, right? And that gives, like I said, that gives you the answer of 55%. So that means this product itself is 55% digestible sugar, because it's what it's not telling you on this nutritional co uh, component is the carbohydrates, because there's no loss in the have to. And there's a reason the loss not there, is because most people wouldn't buy it if it's shown it, okay? So I'll let you work it out. Now starch, which is what, this is how they get the dry food to stick together, plus carbohydrates, digest as glucose, which is sugar, okay? So this particular product, fed for a long time, and if your dog's diabetic, it will do serious harm to your dog, okay? You'll find yourself going to the vets all the time. So why are they feeding it to, for, to dogs when they know full well what it does to certain dogs, okay? The reason being is that it makes money, and that's a simple thing, okay? It's really cheap for them to produce. You're gonna buy it at like 35 pound a bag, and it probably costs them less than a fiver to make, okay? So it's massive, massive profits. But the thing is, it's massive expense out of, your, out of your pocket when you're going to the vets and taking your dogs there, okay? Or your cats. So yeah, I just thought I'd give you a little bit of a heads up on exactly what's in, what's in the dry foods and how to work it out, okay? So please make sure you read the labeling. If you're not too sure, you can't do the numbers, bring them in, okay? And I'll show you myself. But yeah, if you want to put your dogs into a species appropriate diet, something that's going to be better for them and potentially re reduce your vet bills over time, by all means, come in and have a chat with us. And one of our brands does come with free veterinary support as well, so why not? It's a win-win situation, okay? I look forward to seeing all of you, so please come on down and have a chat with me, okay? Thanks a lot.